Good morning, Hawks. I'm Senior Parker Wolf. Today is Friday, October 29th, and today is the B Day. The staff member for the day is Mr. Tubbs for his professionalism and dedication to his students, nominated by administration. Stay tuned on the show to hear about yearbook, weather, sports, and more. Also, in honor of Halloween, I have a Halloween joke for you. Where did the ghost go on vacation? The answer to this joke will be at the end of the show. Now here's Lindsay to kick off the news. What's up, Hawks? It's sophomore Lindsay Stride. Wednesday night, the Tesra yearbook got some amazing news. The National Scholastic Press Association recognized that two spreads from the 2021 yearbook are finalists for Story of the Year. Junior Carolyn Heckel and seniors Sylvia Maxwell and Lily Farron are up for COVID-19 Story of the Year for reporting on last October's two-week shutdown. Senior America Griffin's article in Open Dialogue is a finalist for the Social Justice Reporting Story of the Year. Her article focused on diversity among the staff and faculty here at the high school. Yesterday morning, I had the opportunity to speak to Griffin about her thoughts and feelings on being a finalist and what she hopes the impact of her reporting will be. And then the process of entering it, I kind of felt like this can be seen more on a national level than it already is in my community. And then for it to be recognized in a finalist standpoint, um, it really makes me feel good. And I know that the kids in the article or kids that have related to the article in the past it will make them feel good as well. I hope that people who don't usually think about what my article speaks about or think about racial disparities within our school can kind of see it in a new lens and learn from it and grow from it. Griffin and the other finalists will be finding out who wins first prize for their articles at an online awards ceremony on November 13th. To wrap up this segment, this Sunday is Halloween. If you're lost in what to do with friends and family and haven't already, Tags and Bradley Farms are a great way to celebrate the holiday. We hope everyone has a great weekend, and now on to Riley with your weather. What's up, Hawks? It's freshman Riley Keeler here to deliver today's weather. Today we are looking at a high of 55 and a low of 45. Unfortunately, there's still a chance of 90% chance of rain today. Now on to Shara with your sports report. Hey Hawks, it's freshman Shara Sony here to deliver your sports report. Today is a big day for our girls and boys varsity soccer teams as they take on sectionals in Waverly. Make sure to go support the girls varsity team at 5 and the boys team at 7. Both are facing Elmira for the title of section 4 champions. There is also a football game at home against Union and a cat today. Make sure to show up tonight at 7 wearing your best costume. Now on to Olivia to wrap up the show. I'm sophomore Liv Zocco. Thank you for tuning in to CPP TV, Hawks. If you missed something on the show, you can search our YouTube channel at CPP TV. Also, the answer to the Halloween joke is Malibu. Good one. Hoping everyone has a great day and keep flying, Hawks.